Hey everybody, welcome back to Trinity Dairy. Don't forget to like and share the video, subscribe to the channel, check out our merch store. We'll have a link in the description for that. You can also follow us on Facebook and Instagram. Today is April 25th, 2023. It's pretty nice out today. The sun's shining. It's a little cool out today. Um, I don't know, it's probably in the 40s, mid, lower mid 40s, which isn't too bad. I think that's about normal for this time of the year. But um, finally getting rid of most of our snow now, so that's good. I'm going to attempt to do today is maybe try to start hauling some manure. I've got uh, this barn up here in this lot where I've had heifers in all winter. Let's try cleaning that out. That's got a, everything in there is concrete, so I know I'm not gonna get stuck with the skid steer out there. But I got the little 820 John Deere on the manure spreader. I'm gonna take it over empty in the field that I wanna haul in and make sure that the field's gonna hold up. It should, I think, pretty sandy, but we'll find out. I'd rather do it with an empty, empty load first and see how that holds up. And then we'll go from there. I know the lower end has got some water standing, but I'll just stay away from that spot. And it is, it's corn stubble. It's that field that we opened up last year and put corn in. Um, I could, I've got some sod fields I could go on, but they're further away and I gotta go through some softer ground anyway to get to them, so this is a nice close haul. And I figured we'd, if we can get in there, we'll start there. So I'm gonna run over with this empty, we'll see what that looks like, and then I'll probably start hauling. I should be able to get a few loads hauled before I gotta head out for the bus route this afternoon, so we'll see what we get into. I'm not cutting in bad of course right now I'm empty so I think I'm just gonna do you know maybe a half a load to start with and we'll see how that holds up I don't think I'll have much trouble because that first dip I drove through there looks like it wasn't too long ago there was probably a little water in there yet so that I know is gonna be soft but um, the rest of it seems okay it's obviously gonna be softer because there's no sod here but um, here's my tracks you know where I went here and they didn't really cut it at all so I guess we'll start with half a load or so and we'll see how that looks
Well, if we're gonna get stuck, there should be enough in there to get us stuck. <clears throat> Go see what we can do. felt the wind kick up at my back so we're gonna go down to the other end and spread this way well I spread that load and got to the end and realized I forgot to turn the camera on so that was kind of uneventful for you guys but that spread out nice then this will be plowed or not plowed but I'll work this up again for I'll put corn in here again so if it gets a little clumpy I'm not too worried about it because it'll just get worked in this year but one load did up pretty much a full pass I always leave a little bit in the back just kind of acts as an end gate if I got some sloppy stuff so anyhow since I didn't record the first load we'll go get another one and try it again All right, well, I'll run over and see if I can get some video of spreading this load. I put a little more in here this time, so we'll see if the ground holds up.
these are Justin's 4-H projects this year. That one right there is Katie. She's a registered Gelve. And then the shorter one there, Justin named her Hazel. She's a balancer. So they're not halter broke yet. And so then Justin will actually get to keep Hazel then at the end of the year. So he's pretty excited about his new 4-H project. Going beef. This is Corvette. She's my new Jersey cow. We just got her today. I got her with my own money. So she's all your cow. And she's registered. And hopefully I get to take her to the state fair. Pretty.